So I cast my body into the trials of blood. The knife pierces deep, deep into my lonely eyes. So I can see this black world no more. Whoa, that's pretty hardcore. That's real pain right there. That's how I feel when my mother abuses me. I just want to escape so she can't hurt me anymore. Henrietta, sweetie! Shut up, Mom! Go away! Oh, but remember, Daddy wanted to talk to you in the living room, my dark little princess. Stop calling me a princess. I'm not a beauty queen in a Disney movie. We'll be waiting in the living room. God, she just never stops! Oh, goodness, I am so nervous. What? Have a seat, Henrietta. Oh, a little family chit-chat. Shut up, Mom! Henrietta, as you know, your mother and I have been concerned about your behavior for some time. Are we really doing this again? We've had a hard time coping with the dark things you're into, but we finally had some counseling. And apparently we're not the only parents who have a child that is emo. What? But Daddy and I love our little muffin, even if she's emo or not. I'm not a fucking emo! Don't you even know the fucking death? Do you know how your foul language breaks your mother's heart? Like calling Mommy demon jizz. So listen, sweetie. We've found a camp. No. A camp which is for troubled kids like you, and you get to work outside and learn about responsibility. I'm not going to any fucking camp. It's for two weeks, and when you come back, we can talk about earning back some of your privileges. I won't come back because I'll be fucking dead. I'll walk out of that camp and I'll walk the streets until I probably get picked up and gangbanged by criminals until I'm bleeding out my fucking eyes. They have a horseshoe pit where you can challenge the other kids to horseshoes. Uh.